Hey everybody, it's I Want to Be Retro. Today we're going to set up email notifications in Proxmox. To get started, let's log into the Proxmox web UI. With Data Center selected, expand permissions and click Users, then double click the root user and set the user's email address. By default, Proxmox tries to send emails through the relay of its configured email from address. Select options from the left sub navigation and set the email from address. With the email from address now configured, we can connect to Proxmox via SSH and send a test email. Here we'll pass a string to PVE mail forward to send a test email. We can also review the mail log for troubleshooting and monitoring purposes. Next, I'll log into my inbox and make sure the test email was received. That covers the most basic of email setups, but what if we want to do more advanced SMTP configuration? To accomplish this, we'll need to modify the postfix configuration files via the terminal. First, we'll install some prerequisite packages. Next, we'll need to edit the main postfix configuration file. Comment out the My Destination and Relay Host lines if they exist. For this tutorial, I'll be pasting in a configuration to use Google's Gmail servers. Write the changes to main.cf. Before we go any further, we need to set the root user's email address to use a Gmail account. So navigate back to Data Center, Permissions, Users, and update the email address as needed. Once the email has been updated, navigate back to the shell to complete the SMTP configuration. Now we're going to create a file to store our Gmail credentials so we can authenticate. Paste in the line and update the email address and password as needed and save the changes to the credentials file. Next we'll use the postmap command to update the postfix lookup table and set the permissions on our credentials file so only the root user has access to it. Then we'll restart the postfix service for the changes to take effect. Finally, we'll send another test email, this time using the Gmail SMTP servers. I'll log into my Gmail account and verify that the email was received. 